Hi, this is Rochelle with Scrap Craftastic and I'm just piddling around in the craft lab. I need to go ahead and set up this week in my PR and social media planner. So I'm going to just go ahead and dive into it. Um, I did use a kit from Let's Get Planned. I need to go back and kind of fill in this information. I have it. I just need to fill it in. I did something very, very simple because I think I'm all St. Patrick's day out with the spreads that I've done in my other planners. And if you want to see what I've done, I'll link to the Dollar Tree planner in the iCard up above, as well as I don't think I did a video for my Stalogy, but the photos have been posted around social media, so you can check that out. And if I haven't posted it in the community tab yet, I will do that. So these are the stickers I did for the spring prompt for the Scrap Craftastic Weekly Planner and Journal Challenge. So this is the full sheet. Now I used this sheet in the Dollar Tree Planner, so I'm thinking that I wanna use the rest of these or some of these um, for the week of the, I just wanna say the 15th, for the week of the 18th through the 24th. Also, I have a new mic that I'm using, so I hope it's working okay. All right, let's see, let's, oh, and I pulled out this washi tape. I'm not sure that this goes. This is some of the Petals and Blooms washi tape. And I just was going through some tapes and saw it and I was like, well, let me go ahead and use this. I don't know if it's still good. It might be a little dry rotted because I've had it for so long, but we're gonna go with it anyway. So let's just put a little bit of that down. And I didn't put it down quite straight, but... And I thought this washi tape was kind of spring vibes. All right, now let's do a little something up top. I wish this was a wider washi for this, but maybe I can get away with tearing it, even though it's kind of thin. No, I want it to come from this edge. So that gives us a little bit of that on both pages. Then let's take the bicycle. Oh, that's kind of so big. Should I put it on Saturday and Sunday? Cause it's usually slow on those days anyway. That's what I'm gonna do. Um, let's go ahead and grab these two butterflies. And the plants. And let's see what we can do. I'm gonna put those up there. All kinds of crooked. Oh, can't fix it, so let's just Go with a butterfly. This butterfly needs to go that way too. Huh. All right, let's do this. Trim this off. And I'm just gonna have to do the butterfly this way. Should leave it at that and keep a whole sheet. Let's see, do I have something else that I could use? That I could mix in with this. Maybe I can mix in some of Plant a Dream. I think that's what it was called. Let's see what I have in Isis Ella Jewels. Yes, I can use these. Oh. Maybe not all of them, but a couple of them. 
All right. So these are Plant a Dream from Isis Ella Jules. And I've done this before, I feel like. But let's see. sheets down from Isis Ella Jewels. I do have a discount code for Isis Ella Jewels. It will be in the description box below. I don't think I want to use these two. And I still might end up using um, a bit of the floral here because I need to bring some more color in with so much green. Do I have any small florals? Let me see what I have in my florals book. All right, I don't really have much left in here. I'm not sure how I feel about these pink flowers. I'm just gonna pass on those. So I also have out my spring florals book from Caliber Plan. And I know everything in there is probably entirely too big, but let's take a look. Again, this is Spring Florals by Calva Plant. Oh, it's not all too big. Just not the right colors necessarily, but we can make it work. I'm thinking I'm gonna be using this this week in my, uh, B6 Stalogy. Maybe next week for this planner for Easter too. Because so I want to use these tulip stickers. Let me look at the colors one more time. I think I can get away with a couple of these. Let's do it. Let's take the backing off because I can't get these stickers off. Put this on. Alrighty. Didn't want to pull the page out, but. Okay. Also, I think I want to do some more with this washi. One. Oh, oh, it's too much going on on my desk. <laughs> All right, maybe that wasn't a good idea to put that there. Can I get it back? So I don't know what it is, but I just cannot get the feel for spring <laughs> florals. I just don't, I don't know. I guess it looks okay, but it always, it's a little strange to me. I don't want to pull this whole thing off this time.
That was a little excessive. I still don't feel like I like it that much, but it's okay. I like to do a lot more experimenting in this planner, really. Now I could come back with some bling. That might be why I don't really like it. Let's see. Oh, let's see what I can do with this scallop washi. Maybe that'll help. I'm going to add that. Simply Gilded needs to come back with this again. Because I use it a lot, it makes a great accent and it adds the perfect amount of bling. But I don't ever see it in their shop anymore. This is going to give me a problem because it's perforated and it doesn't want to tear. See, there we go. And I know the scallops are going up, but that's kind of the look I want it. That helped. This still looks a little naked up there. Maybe I should do a date cover. I usually don't do that here. Let's see what I can come up with. I think this is gonna be the spark that I need. Yes. All right, I am happy with that. That's much better. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Let's go ahead and pop this back in. I think I'm gonna keep that sheet in here. Even though I need to organize this pocket a little bit better, kind of just got stuff thrown in and everything is getting a little too bulky for my taste. So here we go. Oh, it turned out so nice. I like it. I think the washi tape and adding the day of the week uh, covers fixed it. I think that's much better. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Even though we got the two small dolls, it does seem like it's missing a doll, but I'm okay with it the way it is. I didn't do any boxes, but I'm just kind of experimenting with a different look with no boxes. So this one was really streamlined, basic, simple. Just a few small stickers and some washi tape. This is a little more elaborate. Uh, let's see where we go for the week of Easter, which is here. So I was gonna stop after, what's the spread? This spread for the week of the 18th through the 24th, but I decided let's go ahead and just do a whole decorating session. So in between time, I have gone back and done some filling in of plans, which kind of help even if I don't plan ahead, going back, filling things in kind of helps me decide what works and what doesn't work. So I chose the horizontal ver version of the printable inserts that are available to Scrap Craftastic Patron, Elite and Unlimited. These are the March inserts. I already have my April inserts here, but I printed the April inserts vertical. And I tend to automatically do that because that's basically what I'm used to. And so it's kind of a habit. But since I've been working in this horizontal, I'm finding that I might like it better for what I need it for. 
and I was kind of getting in a groove with it. So I may change and go back and print the horizontal or I may experiment and see if I can do the same system that I'm doing here in the vertical for April just so that I don't waste them. But I'm going to go ahead and pop these in. Let's see. This is stuck to that. So these will go here. For the month of April and these are printable inserts that come in a variety of different sizes. They are available on the Scrap Craftastic Patreon every month for every month. Okay. So, I started to enjoy this spread a lot more, especially after I started filling it in. Let's go ahead and wrap up the month of March and the week of Easter. I decided to use this washi tape from Simply Gilded, probably. And I have this book, Spring Florals, from Kel of a Plan that I want to get used up. So I'm thinking I want to use this page and then maybe some of these. I don't want to put too many stickers because I want this to be functional too. So let's start off with the washi tape. Um, oh, and this page, maybe. I don't think I'll use boxes this time, not yet. I wanna see how well I can do without the boxes on this layout. So usually I wanna put the darker color at the bottom, but not this time. And I like that torn look. So let's do it again. We may even get a chance to jump into the Stalogy. Just knock it all out together. Then let's do the yellow at the bottom. Okay, that may be a mistake <laughs> now that I think about it because I have these corner florals that I kind of wanted to use, but I don't think I'm going to be able to, but that's okay. Let's use this one. Should I do that? I think I am. Put this one over here. Well, I didn't mean for my butterfly to get cut off, but it can't be helped. Let's rub that down, rub it down, rub it down. May have to use the floral somewhere else. Okay, I'm gonna use these eggs here. Use this butterfly. And I guess I'll use the little duck. I don't really want to put him here because this is where I would put my little list of my social media stuff, but let's see if I can work around it. And I think that might be it for the stickers. Let's see what I can do with a little more washi tape because I don't have any skinny washi that I think will work. So we're gonna use our torn washi look again. Let's see what I can do. I 
I don't think I'm gonna need that piece. Let's see, let's try the yellow. I think the scallop washi would do well on this spread too, but I don't wanna keep using that. I'm almost out. Uh, what other scallop do I have? I don't have any more small scallop like this. What can I do with this? I wonder how this will look torn. I'm not crazy about it, but a little bit won't hurt. That helps it a little bit. And I think one more thing that will help is date covers. Is there anything in Dated Basics from Caliber Plan that I can use? Is there an Easter sticker? Let's use the Easter sticker that's in here. Even though it's huge. Looks like I tried to use this before and put it back. Put it there. All right, back to looking for the date covers or day of the week covers. I don't think these will work. And these are all months, which is not what I need. Let me try something. Let's try one of the Tombos. It's a little dark. but I think I'm just going to go with that. Maybe I should have did yellow, but it's for the purple lovers. Oh, I don't have a doll. Let me see what I have in Coco's Vision. Most of these are probably entirely too big. Oh, I know one that would be perfect, but I think I don't have her anymore. It's the lady with the hat on, not her. Her, I do have her. She's not really the right color. Let's try it anyway. She's not really matchy matchy, but I think I'm gonna keep her. Maybe I can use her too. Let's see what I can find in Isella Jewels dolls. Something light and airy. Maybe I can use Tara. I'm going with that. All right. It's a little all over the place, but I think once I start filling it in, it'll grow on me just like the previous week. All right, so let's go ahead and pop this back in. And this is where I am so far for March. We'll do a quick flip. So we had the dashboards that came out in February that were for March. Uh, my title page, my perks and ideas page. And then this is a freebie, uh, freebie Friday from the Facebook group. Then this is my monthly. This is kind of a little bit of everything. Um, and I did mention earlier, this is a DIY planner. The covers, these covers are from Live Love Posh. The discs are Happy Planner. This is a thank you card or journaling card from 
Let's Get Planned. And I do have a discount code for Let's Get Planned. Everything will be in the description box below. Okay, so this is my first week. I use leftovers from the collage digital available to Scrap Craftastic patrons. And I may start putting the digitals also in my Etsy shop. The older versions from the beginning of the year are in the shop on my Patreon, but I may move everything over to Etsy. We'll see how it goes. Then this is using a kit, just a little bit of a kit from Let's Get Planned. And then I went back and added these little miniature dolls from Isis Ella Jewels. And then this <laughs> is the week of spring, which I didn't note that here, um, but I'll go back and note it. The floral washi tape is from Petals and Blooms, which I mentioned previously. These two dolls are from Isella Jewels. The little floral stickers are Caliber Plan, and then the other stickers are from another printable. That digital is spring, available to Scrap Craftastic patrons right now but check etsy i'll be adding stuff soon and then this one uses washi tape from simply gilded a lot of stickers from Kelava plan the spring florals book and then the dolls are from coco's vision and isis ella jewels and the easter sticker is from Kelava plan as well all right so that wraps up easter in this um do we want to do a full-fledged go-all-out decorating session? So we've done one, two spreads. Can we do two more? Let's try it and see. So that's going to wrap it up for this planner. Let's move into the B6 Stylogy, which is my everyday planner. All right, so I am back with my B6 Stylogy, which is in this pink cover from print pression and this is how it looks in the cover all right this is my everyday planner these are stickers that i want to use for the week of easter so we will get to those this is where we are for march quick little flip i want to show that so this is the previous week and I got a bit of a jump start with my body book page. And I guess I might tip that into um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I think I'm gonna do daily pages. Ugh, but I don't feel like putting down all that washi tape. <laughs> That's one thing that deters me from the daily pages, okay. Did I do washi before? I didn't, but I did previously, but that was two days per page. Okay, so I think I want to use, this is the week in between St. Patrick's Day and the week of Easter. I still wanna do something springy. So I wanna use the yellow tulips. So I wanna go yellow. So if I'm doing that, I didn't pick a doll. It doesn't matter. Does this go all the way across? Yes, it does. Okay. So we may not need a whole lot of washi, even though I pulled these out from Simply Gilded. Should I make them go down the side? I just don't, I don't feel like doing washi this week. We'll see what happens. Or for this week. Kind of jumping down on the paper. Uh, that's a little bit crooked. But I can't do anything about it. It's tearing. Let's take the backing off of this so that I am able to get these stickers off of here because 
fighting with them. Now, well, since the page came out, let's work with it like that. Should I come in from the corner a little bit? I do like that look, leave a little border. The issue is getting it straight when I do that. What's on the next page? Okay, so I got those left. Do I want to use this over here to go ahead and get it used? I'm just going to trim. It's crooked, but I'm just going to trim it. I don't think it's worth fighting with. Let's use these smaller scissors. All right, I think I'm gonna finish that page so that I can toss it. Now, let's see. I didn't want to do tape, but I think I'm gonna do tape at the end no it's gonna be a lot of tape let me concentrate <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna tear it neatly though let's tear it let's do the raggedy edges that'll make it go faster I'm already starting off wrong Putting it down crooked. <laughs> this tape is really, really sticky. Let's see what we can find for days of the week. Don't think I'm going to have much success here. Can I use those? I could use them just to get them used. They don't really match. Don't really like them that much. But let's see. Let's start with Monday. It's not so bad. Do I want to do it like that and put the number underneath? Then I have all of this room to write. Because I'm, I'm really thinking about going more journal style with this instead of planning because basically what I do every week is just put down. I know that's probably crooked. Oh, yeah. Basically what I do each week is put down the weekly tasks that I do, like the trash. Um, and this is why I turned it upside down so I can have it closer to me so I can actually see what I'm doing. But trash, laundry, payday, things like that, um, that I could really just put on the monthly calendar maybe. I don't know. 
those minor things though i could still put them on the daily or weekly layouts but just use them more for journaling we'll see spit that up if I can make myself some more room here Friday Monday is the 18th Let's see what we got to work with here did I already use the first day of spring I think so or maybe it's not even in here. Who knows? All right. Almost had them all. Oh, I can use this. I think I'm just going to use these. No, I don't like her with that. I think I'll keep her with the other page. Oh, I need a doll with beautiful yellow on, but I know I don't have one. Let's see what I have available in Let's Get Planned. She's not wearing yellow, but I might use her. Lavender will work too. Hmm. I'm surprised that I don't have more than that. So since she is the biggest doll that I have that will work, she will go here. From Let's Get Planned. Leave a room above in case I want to do a quote. So empty sheet. Mm -mm. There's just nothing else in there that I think will work. So I'm not going to make you wait while I look through all my stickers. Um, so hang tight and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. Um... Boy, this was a struggle. I almost decided that I would have to make my own dolls, but I'm just not in the mood to do that. So I pulled this out and I think I can use these Chella Creates dolls because they are nice and pastel. Even though they're not yellow and lavender, I think I can work with them. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, I even love these flowers. They may go with my next week, my Easter week. I think they will. And I don't think this kit has any dolls either. No, no, ooh, I might have to use these twice. <laughs> these were cut with the Cricut and not very well. All right, I also discovered that I didn't put tape on this page. Uh, since we already have a doll here, I'm not going to do one there. Ooh, she looks awkward. Let's put her on Friday. Or not. Or, yeah. Oh, but I didn't put the tape down here. Oh, uh, I think I'm tired. It's been a rough day. I took quite the break in between looking for dolls. And so much has happened. And tomorrow is a big day. And I'm a little bit exhausted today. And I'm sure I'll be a little bit more exhausted tomorrow. I had some un unexpected running around to do today. And I'm just pooped at this point. 
Oh, she's huge. For her on Wednesday. All right, I think I like that. Pretty nice, pretty nice. So we're missing something here, but do we really need something? I also pulled these uh, stickers out from Let's Get Planned. So I'm thinking I can use a little something from these as well. Let's use this one. These have been floating around for a while, so I kind of want to use them. Let's put that one there. Since we don't have much going on on Saturday and Sunday. Let's do this. That doesn't look that cute on that page. I don't think I want to use that on here. This one is not going to work. So I'll probably end up putting those in my sticker book. That one's finished. These are for the next week. I think that's good. I don't know. I've been feeling more simple spreads lately. I could have put this here. Nope, that wouldn't have worked. Okay. So let's put down, I think I'll use the top portion of these pages to do my tasks. See how that goes to place tasks for the week and then use the lower portion for journaling. Maybe, we'll see. Let me get all the usual tasks out and then we can keep it going. Let's grab a couple of boxes, not too many, mainly for the things that I know are happening this week. Okay, so I think that is good for this week. Let's move on to the next week. Okay, so I am back to do the last week of March and the week of Easter in my B6 style G. Everyday planner temporarily may be a journal with some planning aspects. Okay, so I got washi tape out here because I was working on something else. I don't think I'm gonna be able to use her this time I might save her for a future spread. I pulled out these dolls from Let's Get Planned to possibly work with. These were the closest things that I could find to go with this kit, their Easter 2024 kit. It's mostly deco stickers with some border pieces. Oh, and it did come with the days of the week, okay because I was looking through another book to see what I could use for days of the week. I don't really want to use these borders here. I may end up using them on my April setup in the PR and social media planner, but these are the washies that I pulled. And I'm thinking of possibly doing side washi this time. I am so undecided on what I want to do with this, but I got these two multicolor. All of this is from Simply Gilded. I'm gonna see what it looks like at the bottom. And I think I wanna do the torn look again, even though this is upside down. So this is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday.
So this is Tuesday, Wednesday. Then let's see if we can play around with this a little bit. I hardly ever use this washi. I don't know how I like that, but I'm going to go with it. Let's go ahead and figure out what's going to happen up at the top. Am I going to do this at the top? I guess so. I think that's pretty nice. All right, let me see if I got numbers in Dated Basics that I can use. I really don't want to use those purple. I should just use these again, huh? Okay, I think I'm going to use these. So that is Kelleva Plan Dated Basics. Let's do the days of the week. I wanted to use, where is she? This doll for my beginning of the week. Let's go and pop over here to Easter because I'm itching to use this Happy Easter. Let's put that right there. I wish I had more florals from this, but there's not. Now let's go ahead and add some dolls, which I probably should have added them first. Okay, so that one is finished. I think I want to use her on Easter. I won't put one on that page. I'm gonna put her on here as well. Sorry I'm not talking a lot. I'm just kind of concentrating on what I'm doing here. All right, so this is Good Friday. I use two sheets down. I probably won't use her and, or her. I think we're good with the dolls. Right? So.
so I do have something on Wednesday that I need to mark let's go for the blue I'm gonna put it up here let's see let me get this rabbit in on the action And then let's give it an egg or two. All right, let's put this on Tuesday. Let's get these couple of eggs. I do want to put another rabbit, but I won't. Okay, I need to deal with this. Do I want to just write these in? Can barely see that. Let's get to the test. Oh, I got some in the front that I need to use. I think I have everything that I need. Let's put this here underneath. Then on Thursday for trash day. So that's the main things for the week. I'll fill this in as needed. I feel like I need to put something else on Monday. Maybe I'll do some bullet points for the week. A few things I wanna accomplish. All right, so we have wrapped up the month of March doll from let's get planned florals most of the big florals are from kell of a plan and then the small florals are from let's get planned the days of the week are from kell of a plan the date dots are from kell of a plan the boxes are available to scrap craftastic patrons the dolls well this these other two dolls are from cella creates i'll have everybody linked below that i can and then washi tape is simply gilded and i think that covers that doll from let's get plan wash tape simply gilded kit the easter 2024 kit is let's get planned and all of these dolls are from let's get planned so this is basically a let's get planned spread all right or set up because these are daily pages so it's not technically a spread but that is done so i gotta figure out what i'm gonna do with her she just doesn't she doesn't flow with this look it's a little too sophisticated for this. This is more whimsical. Okay. All right. So I think we are done. That is the end of the decorating session. Um, that's everything for March. Let me know what you think of the spreads. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And you may be interested in this other video. Thanks for watching. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.